Hello, welcome. My name is Emily and I just remembered I have to put on a band-aid and I don't have any. Okay. Um, I have an infection on my cuticle, which isn't nice to <laughs> watch, but I'm going to try to keep it away from the camera. This is the Beauty A to C project. Jessica and Amanda are the creators of this project. It has been going on for years and it's a year long and it ends on the last day of the year. Uh, one item for every elf, every alphabet, no, every letter in the alphabet. And in Sweden, we have three more than in the English alphabet. Today, I have four empties. Uh, and that means that I have four. I have to write it down. One, two, three, four. I had eight, so 12 in total out of 29, but I'm very close on many. So first we have, uh, not on that side, uh, we have the Australian Glow Lotion for uh, L, uh, Gradual Tanning Lotion. I was here, now it's done. Um, it smelled nice. It didn't tan that much. Uh, I liked it in the beginning and it's nothing wrong with it, but it doesn't do that much. So I don't think, maybe I don't want to buy it again. We will see. It's sometimes nice with a, just a little hint of color. So who knows? Then we have for O, the overnight light cleanse dry shampoo from Batiste. Um, this is done uh, and this grew on me. <laughs> I, I thought it was unnecessary in the beginning but then I thought it was a nice very light dry shampoo cleanse which is kind of nice for the night and because I have oily hair so it's nice to wake up with not that oily hair. So I will probably buy that again. That went down from 60 grams to 46, something about that. And the Australian Glow was about 60 grams that I used up. I have also finished this one for Q, Quick Fix Moisturizing Cuticle Balm from Butter London that I bought for this project. Uh, it wasn't anything special, really not. It was like a hand cream or something. So. No, I'm not going to buy that again. And the last one is for uh, S, the Super Light Daily Wrinkle Defense with SPF 30 from Paula's Choice. I did not like this. This just stuck in my pores and it has a tint and I'm going to show you because it's not, I have product left, but I'm not going to squeeze it out anymore. <laughs> I could, but I don't want to. It looks like this, and I'm going to show you on my hand. Uh, you, you see that it's, it's very light first, and that's fine. But I'm not sure you can see that it has a grey tone, at least for my skin, and it doesn't work. I don't understand why it's coloured. It, it could be no colour. It had been much, much nicer if it had been see-through or white or whatever. So I'm very glad to have it done. I'm sure I can press out some more, but I don't want to. So I'm I'm pleased with this one. And I really didn't think it did anything for my skin. That's good. So I used up seven grams of that one. Now to the things I have still in this project. And what did I say? 29. Uh, <laughs> 17 items left. So for A, we have the Acidic Bonding Concentrate, the Redken Shampoo. And I have it upside down now. I'm there. So only this much left. I was there, so I haven't used up that much. But this is very drygt, as we say in Sweden. You don't need much. Um, and I have been uh, using another shampoo because I ha have some ex eczema is that the word and dry patches on my scalp and i don't want to use anything that could do it worse so i'm trying to use it on the top of my scalp but not in the back 
but this will probably be gone by the next update I'm sure no I'm not sure but I think I have used up 30 grams of that then for C we have the calm soothing toner from Ola's Choice I haven't used it that much only this little progress I used this actually on my scalp um, didn't work that good but I'm trying now the last days to use it more um, I'm not gonna buy that again either don't see the point of that one for F, we have the Philorgia Time Filler Eyes, which I love. I always say that. This one, um, I have that much left. I'm very, <laughs> I'm using it very sparingly now, only in the evenings. And yeah, um, it's gonna take a while to use it up, but I don't care because I love it and it is very expensive. We have for G the vitamin C glow eye patches from Revolution. These, uh, which I like a lot. And these, I have used them a few times. I'm more than halfway, I think. They are very slippery, <laughs> but they are nice. Uh, so I used up... Uh, 14 grams of these, hard to say how many that is, but yeah. I don't mind using them, but I forget. We have for I, the Indie Beauty Antioxidant Hydrating Spray, which I haven't used that much either. Um, don't really know why, actually. Um, before I use it every morning, I have not. Uh, but I'm gonna take this to the boat and use it there because I think I will need it more there. I have used up 10 grams of that. The uh, eye cream I used up one and a half grams or a bit less. Then for J, I switched out the uh, glycolic peeling gel and put in a um, body wash from Espa. Espa. Uh, this little thing, but I'm not done with it. I am there. This is also very, very drygt. Uh, you don't need much. It smells a lot. Uh, very flowery or something. Bergamot and jasmine. And it's a bit much <laughs> actually, but yeah, it's not much left. Then we have a sad uh, thing that I always say. We have for K, Flux Mot Caries. Uh, it's a tooth um, mouth rinse. Uh, <laughs> I think I used it twice. Look at this. Why can't I use it? It's so annoying. I'm never going to go through this um, when I use it so sparingly. It's very annoying. I forget about it and I don't know where to put it to remember because I don't want to use it in the bathroom because I brush my teeth there. There, So I want to use it. <laughs> so I have it in the kitchen and I don't see it. It's yeah, very annoying. Then for N we have the Naturel, Natural uh, Silky and Hold Hairspray Original. I have used up 42 grams of this and it's not much left. This is a big one. And it's really silky, which I'm not sure I like. But I think I'm down here somewhere. So that's great. We have for R, uh, but I don't have the products here. They are also something I replaced uh, in the last update. I have three products from Rituals. The body cream, the SPF body and the shower foam. But they are at the boat, so I can show you them. Then for T we have the facial, no, Dermaceutic uh, turnover. That was also something I switched out and I have only tried it once so I have used up very little of this. I can't do another mark uh, but I'm almost done with another nighttime cream <laughs> so I will use this when I'm done with that. And for V, 
we have the Vitt Vaselin from, from Meds. It's in Swedish and this looks horrible. I have to wipe it down. <laughs> I can show you that. And why it looks so bad is because I have a highlighter or yeah, a highlighter mixed in with my body cream lotion and then I take this after and I'm brown kind of on my hands so yeah a bit better this is not done yet but I'm getting there um, you don't need much of this either I I'm not sure I'm down here somewhere I'm, I'm not gonna do a line so hopefully I can have that done the next update also I have used up nine grams of that for W, we have Ida Vai Self Tanning Water Mist. And because I uh, was done with a gradual tan product, I use this now. Actually, not on my face. And it's milky. I don't know why. I don't think it was when I started using this. But it's a spray and I have used it on my legs a few times and on my arms. So good progress on that one. Uh, then we have X, Got To Be Too Sexy Volumizing Spray Mousse uh, from Schwarzkopf. And this is, this has a very nice scent. It smells like raspberries. And I'm down, down here somewhere. Very low on this one. I like it, but I have another mousse that is, that is much better. So I want to use that up. And then we have Y. Uh, we have the Yves Saint Laurent, Mont Paris, this one, and you can see I have really worked on this one uh, much more than I had before, so I don't have much left in this either. I have used up 30 grams of that volumizing mousse. Uh, I used up 18 grams of the self tanning mist. Sorry, I forget to tell you. And I used up two grams of the perfume. Then we have Z. And I realized that I forgot something. I always forgot this, forget this because I have written it off, even though it's not done. And that is for uh, D daily smoothing treatment. 5% AHA from Paula's Choice and I thought I was going to be able to finish this. It's very top heavy and it goes up the product. So I'm kind of sick of this. I think the pump is the one thing that has to wait. I hope I can finish this soon. I really hope and actually think I can. I used up 9 grams of that. But I didn't think it was that much product. And then for Z, the 10% acylic acid booster, also from Paula's Choice. And this I have used a lot. Uh, it's empty up here. It's all only product down here. It's a very strange tube. Uh, but this is almost done too. Not almost done. I have a lot. Not a lot, but I have some left. We will see. Uh, I used up four grams of that. And the last two products is for the letter letter Ö. And I have two um, Swedish products from Björn Axen. Uh, I have a spray and I have a mousse. And the mousse I haven't used because I want to finish the other thing. And these are just minis. But the spray I use once. So I used up three grams of this. But it shouldn't be a problem to finish these. But I want to finish these two first. So I... Yeah. So, 17 products left. And for next update... I have said it, but I will go through them again. I think I can finish this one. One. And this. Two. And this. Three. And this, I think. Four. Um, can I finish this? Maybe five. Um, this six, seven, 
8. So it should be a good update next time. And this, I forgot. Forgot this. I'm going to finish. Just kidding. No. So 8. And then I'm at 20 finished products. Uh, and only 9 left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yes. I'm grouping these as 1. And the ones that are at the boat is also 1. So it's a bit more than... We will see. Hope I can. I really hope. Subscribe if you haven't already and hope to see you in another video. Bye bye.